vision in the chain and nobody see it. I still hustle anyway. They wonder how you supposed to make it, no mistake, and all I can get you. Keep grinding, it's okay. And I put this shit on everything. Put that on everything. I gotta go hard, gotta make it to the top. Put this shit on everything. That's on my daddy, girl. I gotta go hard, gotta make it to the top. Grind hard every day to what I'm gonna do. Cause the niggas seen the struggle we was going through. Sleeping at bus stations. Oh, it's dark. It ain't too dark. It's the angles, I guess. What's good? Uno gang, it's your girl. What's up, people of the fucking internet? It's dark, it's light, it's dark, it's light, it's dark, it's light. I gotta figure out my camera and how to work it. I don't I don't really know how to operate my camera no more. Um, but anyway, I'm starting this vlog because I'm on my way to Chicago. And um, we are preparing to go to Atlanta for... A pop-up shop for my brother we getting rid of some merch so as y'all know he was doing um, well he has a clothing line YBE which it could be young black entrepreneurs young beautiful entrepreneurs he's trying to branch off of you know just so it can be a variety of cultures when YBE um, so we're going to uh, Clark Atlanta University this week and yeah, I'm uncomfortable with my camera setting, so I, I really want to play this back and see what's going on because it looked really dark, and I know I can make this light, so let me get right back to y'all once I get this fixed. Six hours later. And I just made it to my destination, y'all. This has been the longest drive of my life, bro. I drove 13 hours straight out to Atlanta, right? I'm going to be taking y'all with me on my little... uh experience with bro now you feel me you feel me i i i should have did my um intro a long time ago but i made it you know i'm here you feel what i'm saying and i'm finna just go ahead get my life together this bath don't go hard shower go hard because this booty is definitely calling for some water you feel what i'm saying but yeah i just want to check in with y'all let y'all know we finna have a dope ass weekend in atlanta and then i'm driving all the way back to wisconsin yeah, I'm excited, man. I'm just a little stinking too, so let me go ahead and handle this business and I'll get back to y'all. The next day. All right, y'all, so it's a new day. I ain't taking my camera home yesterday. I uh, well, to the room with us because I, we left everything in the car, but we setting up and I'm gonna show y'all how we set up, but this is one hell of a day already. Cause I can't report myself the right way. <laughs> Later that same evening. All right, y'all. So due to the circumstance, um, I think I might actually back on topic cause I ain't even started the topic and I'm off topic cause my brain is off topic. But I might be, um, <sighs> leaving earlier than I thought, which is fine because I gotta drive 14 hours to get home, so the sooner I get home, the better, because y'all know Angel and I have plans and arrangements for certain things, so um, about Atlanta, Clark Atlanta, yesterday um, so far what we got at yesterday, everybody was coming in so um, today is supposed to be a better day as far as sales because yesterday it was just a lot of the alumni coming back and um, it wasn't even a lot of people out like it got crowded a couple times but not the way they hyped it up to be so you know and we still got some decent sales too but for how they hyping it up today got to be the day or well, what today is Friday right? it's Friday so it got to be Friday uh, Friday of the uh what is it homecoming weekend they told us we couldn't bring our trucks on the thing but then I see a bunch of people got their trucks on the thing they showing favoritism look at them they all got their trucks on the pavement thing but okay 
I need to come, definitely need to come down there. I see a, a ice truck with hella bags of ice. I need ends on the ice. And most shit, if you don't get it in the morning, you probably get an I don't care about it movement. Like grocery stores, right? You know how the grocery stores, they put all their fresh shit out in the morning. And if you don't catch it in the morning, you got to get the, get it from the lazy folks that's there in the evening. Or if it's the same people, they tired, so they ain't putting all the same effort into the shit type shit. But I'm going to park the truck. Um, then I'm going to walk back and talk about something different. And then, woo, woo, woo. get back to y'all. Woo, in a minute. Uh. Good morning, good morning. So today is our last day at the event. Um, we did, we made a, we got sales both days. Um, I don't know what bro goal was. But the lady who was next to us, she said when she come out and do her sales, she liked to make her um, her vendor's fee. And then, because she live in Atlanta, so she liked to make her vendor's fee back and then something else. But um, with bro, I was thinking he wanted to get rid of maybe everything, if not everything, at least half because... I guess it would make sense to want to make your vendor's fee back and then we stand in a nice ass hotel. So you probably he probably want to make his hotel money back and then he probably want to make the gas money because I drove here and he flew here. So he probably want to make all that money back to see profit. But I don't know. So, you know, but um, yesterday we did better than the first day. Hopefully today we do a lot better than both two days. Um, either way, you know, it was a positive experience and he did it for a good cause. So, you know, I'm sure he's not going to trip because my brother is really positive. I wonder if he related to my family because I got some negativity in me. And Wayne is pretty negative, too. My mama negative, too. Nah, we're not just stupid negative people, though. But anyway, yeah, he's handling everything super positive. Um, it's going to be just me and him today. Um, my other, his, his close friend is like his brother. Which is bro Ron. He left already this morning. So, um, today the last day. And I'm still debating if I'm going to drive straight home. Or, you know, come get a couple hours of sleep. And get up early in the morning. Because I do have school Monday. And I need to work all week. <sighs> Y'all, I be so busy. I'm going to drive myself crazy one of these days. Shout out to JoJo for rocking it out with me. Right, babe? She's my mm-hmm. Always. Shut the hell up. Anyway... But yeah, um, this has been a great experience. Yesterday was fucking amazing. It was so many people. We seen DJ Drama. I posted those pictures. We seen, uh, I seen, ja what's her name? Jessica Dime. I think that's her name. The chick from All Love and Hip Hop. And I seen uh, that one guy that went uh, TikTok famous, Terry Reloaded. I seen a lot of nice people out here. Definitely a good experience for me, for sure. But, um... I don't know what footage I'm going to get today, but my brother got five minutes to bring his ass. I ain't show y'all my room, but it is fine. Look at my view, though. Let me show y'all my... I got to show y'all my view. Hey, I like this little Mercedes, Mercedes Benz joint. But, yeah, so, um, yeah, that's, that's just about it for real. My camera is kind of charged up. I'm going to throw it on the charge when we get to the uh, car. So while we unloading everything, I could be juicing up a little bit. And that's it. Let's see what we get to the end. I'm, I'm just going to, we're going to rock out like that. Game. We got some talented little dancers out here, man. They got some YouTube channels. I want y'all to go check them out. Big dancers. Yeah, he a big dancer. What's your YouTube name? T-O-O-M-N-U. He do TikTok too. He cold. This the cameraman. Shout out your Instagram. I'm cameraman. Yeah, check them out. Yo, yo, gang girl. I just pulled up on bro ass, my brother Deshaun from film school. 
chopped it up with him for a hot little minute. He finna bail out to go get him an oil change, and I'm finna bail out to head the fuck home. We got a long 12 hours, baby. I just wanted to clock in, let y'all know I'm clocking out of the A. A. Sales was okay, I'm assuming. I did pretty good. I got us, I got bro, uh, 220 followers on Instagram. Y'all check bro, uh, Brandon out on Instagram, YBE underscore apparel. Hopefully I get them more followers through Uno Gang. You feel me? And that's that. You know, Atlanta has been nice to me. It always has. Everyone who I fuck with will not typically come here. If I hit you up to fuck with you and you couldn't make it your business to fuck with me, I'm not fucking with you anymore. Please let that be public service announcement. Because every time I come here, I fuck with people. And it's like, you know, I'm done giving out energy that I don't fucking receive from other people. And that's what my brother Dave was just telling me, like, oh, no, you too good of a person, G. Like, you got to prioritize yourself because you always being dependable and making a motherfucker your priority. Anytime motherfucker asks you for some shit, you get it done, G. That's why I respect you. His little country ass. His little country ass accent, but. Yeah, so. Just know. A few motherfucker handed me some scissors to cut them the fuck off. But I hope they don't give a fuck because I don't either. But on another note, time to get home to my babies, y'all. That's all I had to say. Oh, bro lost his fucking AirPods because them people said they ain't found them. That's one thing I don't like about Beats. They don't got no locator on them because I lose my AirPods. I know where I lost them at because I have a location on them. But until I make it home or stop at a gas station or do something that makes me want to say something to y'all, baby. I'm out! He, he lost! <laughs> and he made all them do push-ups because he won. Bro just had to do push-ups. <laughs> hey, bro had all them doing push-ups. But he got bro ass. It's called the gym club. I got these little niggas in shape. You know what I'm saying? They go get their little cubs. They really got a gymnast. That shit ain't gonna help. You next? Come on. Why be you, baby? I gotta go hard, gotta make it to the top. Hey, hey, girl, hard that day to what I'm gonna do. Cause the niggas seen the struggle. We